Hey filmmaker Shongni here. In this video I'm going to show you how I did this text or title tracking inside of Premiere Pro. So here we have a title and a text that is not tracking yet. So first thing we are actually going to add something to the text. We're going to add a X marker. So on the bottom or actually anywhere that you want you just type the letter X and we're actually going to make this a thin font and yeah century gothic regular is nice and thin so just choose a font that is very thin so it can help you guide you where to hold the marker and I actually already chosen like a spot that is this little thing here you see like a bit of metal that is showing uh, on the clamp and we're going to track this spot. So it's actually already on that spot. We're going to show this text again. So we just need to make sure it's moving from there onto that spot. So we're right now inside of the text effect and we're going to the transform section and we're going to hit toggle animation to turn on the keyframe. So it now makes a keyframe that it's following this spot. We're going to hold down shift and press arrow to the right to jump five frames. And we're then just holding the X and move it across the section that we want to track. And basically this is what we're going to do the whole time. So hold down shift and then press arrow again and move this. So because it's jumping five frames every time, we can easily get this done much faster. And once you have everything done, we can actually go back through it and clean it up to get a nicer track. So this is a quick and dirty track first to get it done as fast as possible without wasting a lot of time going frame by frame. So we're just going every five frames we add a keyframe and change the position of the text. So we've just finished adding all the keyframes and we can now play it and see how it tracks. And actually it already tracks it very well. And actually it tracks it already enough. So we can already see there isn't too many sp spots where it goes off too far and it actually already tracks it quite well. So we can actually already keep it how we how this is. And now we can literally hit text source, hit the type tool and remove the X on here. And now if we play it, we get a nice tracking. So there was text or title tracking inside of Premiere Pro. It's pretty quick and pretty easy to do. Hope you guys like this video and please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more upcoming videos, please subscribe. Also check out my other videos on this channel. If you have any questions, please comment below or join us on our Facebook group. There's a link in the description and I hope to see you the next time. Bye bye.